Hello dear students, in this class we are going to show that every non-zero element of Zn is either a unit or a zero divisor. Before this we have already shown that any non-zero element of a finite commuted during with unity is either a unit or a zero divisor that is already shown. This is just a particular case of it but since the question is there in the question bank we will also see the proof of it. Now here uh, we will begin by taking a non-zero element of Zn. So we will say let a bar be a non-zero element of Zn. Now as seen in the previous theorem same logic works here there will be two cases either a GCD of A with N will be equal to 1 or GCD of A with N will be greater than 1. So in the case when the GCD is 1 we will show that uh, this A bar is a unit and if the GCD of A with N is greater than 1 in that case we will show that this A bar is a 0 divisor. Let us recall the definition of unit. Unit means what? A non-zero element whose inverse exists with respect to multiplication. Now in this case in order to show A bar is a unit we need to find some element of Zn whose multiplication with A bar is actually equal to what? 1 bar. Now I will say if GCD of A with N is equal to 1 then now see uh, there is one result we already know if GCD of AB is 1 then we will be able to find such integers M and N such that MA plus NB is equal to 1. So this logic we will use so we will say uh, since GCD of A and N is 1 this will imply there exist uh, let us call them as x and y belonging to z such that what will happen this uh, ax plus ny will be actually equal to 1. Now just take bar on both sides so this will imply this ax plus ny bar is actually equal to 1 bar which further implies a bar x bar plus n bar y bar is equal to 1 bar. Now since we are in Zn what will be n bar? As we know if we are in Z6 then 6 bar is actually nothing but 0 bar. So this n bar is actually going to be 0 bar. So this implies this will be a bar x bar will be equal to 1 bar since n bar is actually equal to 0 bar in Zn. So indirectly what we have proved? So we are able to find a number x bar such that a bar multiplied by x bar is equal to 1 bar right and this implies a bar is a unit. Now if GCD of a and n let us say is greater than 1 now in this case we are going to show that this a bar is a 0 divisor. Now what do we mean by 0 divisor? Now we have to find a number in Zn such that a bar multiplied by that number should be equal to 0 bar. Now remember that number should be non-zero as well. I mean we have to find a number in Zn such that the multiplication of that number with a bar is actually equal to 0 bar but this quantity should be also non-zero that is essential right. Now since GCD of a n is d according to the definition of GCD what will happen d will divide a and d will divide n. Now d divides a what is the meaning of it? Let us recall divisibility a divides b if and only if b is equal to a k for some k belongs to z right. So what will happen here is as 
d divides a this implies a will be equal to some let us say ds for some s belongs to z now what we have to do we have to find a number whose multiplication with a bar is equal to 0 bar and obviously that number should be non zero now see what is my choice of that number so i'll say note that a bar multiplied by i will choose my number to be n upon d bar which is further equal to what is the value of a ds so just put it there so d bar s bar n upon d bar this uh, d bar and d bar will get cancelled out that is what you can say so this is actually equal to s bar into n bar now again this n bar is 0 bar in zn so this is equal to 0 bar since this n bar is equal to 0 bar in zn uh, so clearly uh, this quantity is going to be non zero as uh, this n is a natural number and this quantity d is also greater than 1 so this number is not going to be non zero that is not an issue so we are successfully able to find a non zero number in zn such that the multiplication of a bar with that number is equal to 0 bar and therefore we will say a bar is a 0 divisor. That is what we wanted to show. Thus what we have shown is any non-zero element of Zn is either a unit or a 0 divisor.